Point and Relief Road was designed and built by Graham Construction. There's a two and a half kilometre highway that connects the A555 and the A523 near Poynton. The road will relieve congestion in Poynton and surrounding areas and better connect Cheshire with South Manchester. Quite early on in the life of the, the new Cheshire East Council, um, we started to look at our, our, our local plan and um, we were able to incorporate the point and relief road proposals that had come out of the South East Manchester Multimodal Study into our local plan because as well as um, relieving Poynton of the additional traffic in the A523 which runs through the centre, um, we were able to configure the road in a way which would help the borough achieve its economic targets of delivering housing and economic growth. The project is not only a highway scheme, but also an environmental scheme. We have significant mitigation measures for Great Crested Newts, Badgers and Bats. We've also planted over 30,000 new plants and trees on the scheme. Uh, the road contains a three metre wide cycleway footway path along the full length, one new bridge for Chester Road to go over the new road, and there is two accommodation bridges uh, for local farmer access. The three bridges are reinforced concrete integral structures, reducing the need for future maintenance. Graham Construction won, won the competition to design and construct Point and Relief Road. Um, that competition was um, based heavily on quality, the quality component, um, and we're very keen in that to make sure that we explored how contractors would minimise delays to the travelling public. A key focus really was Chester Road and one of the things Graham came up with was actually making Chester Road a slightly wider structure and only moving those, those utilities once and that's obviously led to savings in terms of programming costs so very pleased with the innovation that Graham has uh, shown on this. Here we are in the world famous Lancaster bomber. Um, over 7,000 of these bombers were made during the World War, uh, during World War II, uh, of which 4,000 came out of where we are today at Woodford. They were designed by Roy Chadwick, a very famous aircraft designer, who joined Avro in 1911. Many people would put him as the most foremost aircraft designer of his time during that period. It was unfortunate that in 1947, he had a crash just off the runway, which is where the point and bypass is now. So we were extremely pleased that a plaque was arranged and paid for by Graham Construction in memory of Roy Chadwick and the other three people who died in that accident. To name the road the Roy Chadwick Way is absolutely fantastic for us and the family and for the area which was so important. A lot of the success of this project goes down to the collaborative working between Graham Construction, our designers Arcadis and our clients Cheshire East, Stockport Council and their technical approvers Jacobs. Mm -hmm.